All right, we got some news coming out. I seen it yesterday. A shout out to Raw and Marcellus Wiley. I seen uh, their videos on it, but Lil Wayne got a, a reportedly a, a show or podcast coming out with Skip Bayless. Lil Wayne, you know, is it? Yeah, I'm really working with Skip Bayless. You know, now that's my brother. Yeah, they're going to be supposed to be working together on a show. Lil Wayne was kind of undisputed. Was it on Fridays? He was on here and there. Uh, when, of course, he'd be on there sometime talking about the NBA, NFL, all that good stuff. Wayne's a big time sports fan, big time Packer fan, so on and so forth. And Skip pretty much is coming off uh, undisputed. They was at their lowest ratings since Shannon Sharp left. And, you know, it's just ironic how Shannon Sharp then blew up and got one of the biggest watched videos of all time interviews with cat williams really in history and you know skip a lot of people kind of have moved have moved away from skip but honestly i i don't i don't know i don't know if this show will work honestly i don't i think a lot of i think skip skip time has came up all good things come to an end you know um i didn't i did not I was not feeling the way Skip treated Shannon Sharp, especially about that whole Tom Brady situation. But like, if you want to go back to maybe, I remember Cold Pizza back in 05, 05-ish, 05, 06. And, you know, I remember, I'm like, okay, you know, there was a lot of stuff I disagree with. But at the time, you know, Skip was explosive. He was the only one really on TV, to my knowledge. I mean, I guess you could argue uh, Jim Rome, but I know he had like a radio show, but I, I, I feel like personally Skip was more like made for strictly ESPN morning uh, television. And he kind of helped really bring sports, that type of format of sports debate to a whole nother level. I do remember the best damn sports show in the early 2000s and they kind of was on there, but I know they wasn't on ESPN. And you know, back then ESPN was the cream of the crop of sports. You didn't have YouTube and Google and all this other Twitter or X now. You didn't have all these different reels. Most of the old things was on ESPN, but you know, nonetheless, I do think that this probably get a little buzz. They might be able to get people on there, but a lot of people feel some kind of way about Skip. If people watch this, it's only because of Lil Wayne. And I don't know how much range can Lil Wayne have when it comes to sports. Like, is he going? Is he going to start talking about if they bring up LeBron? Is he going to start talking about the 1970s and all of that, or is he just going? You know, you know, Brian. You know, that's my brother. You know, he. You know, he's a hell of a player. I don't have nothing bad to say about Brian. And you know, Skip kind of changed his tone as well with LeBron when Shannon left. So I don't know. I mean, I, I liked Keyshawn when he was there. Michael Irvin was even when he was there. Uh, Richard Sherman, but I know he had his, you know, his unfortunate things going on. And uh, Paul Pierce. So I'm wondering, will those guys still stay at Fox uh, FS1? But I don't know, man. I don't know. I, I think it might, it might be over for Skip, you know. So a lot of people are happy about it and. Like I said, when he went off on Shannon the way he did, that was the final blow. You know, between that, the DeMar Hamlin situation, at some point, you know, people won't, people will tolerate you for so long. But once Shannon Sharp became a clearly bigger star, it was over from there, you know, for Skip. So, you know, and like I said, I, I do think a lot of it was Skip and Shannon. I don't think nobody realized Shannon was going to blow up way as big as he was. Because remember, Skip brought Shannon on. Skip fought Sh fought for shannon to come on and skip was the bigger name but at some point shannon just went to a whole nother level but yeah i don't know we'll see how long this show lasts or you know what format what station it'll be on or will it be on regular tv will it just be on spotify or apple music whatever but i just want to get my quick thoughts about it and tell me what y'all think